What's going on guys? Welcome back to some more live action. Haven't uploaded in a couple days. Figured I'd give you guys another one. Been practicing a little bit, getting back to the form we once were. And let's jump in. Leading off for us will be the very dangerous Barry Larkin. And first pitch goes right down the middle. And this guy is going to be a troll, I can already tell. And we just missed that. We're going to make the adjustment if he continues this. One down. Okay, so he f figures out a way to tunnel that pitch and uses a sinker with it. Boom, there we go. Eddie Matthews, deep left field, 1-0. You can't tunnel a two-seamer with it. Let's go. It would appear my opponent has a good eye, but it's not really a good eye. He's taking pitches to take them. We well, just buckled you with that curveball. I do expect him to adjust down here now after that curveball. So now we're going to throw a slider out of the zone. Foul off, okay. We showed him fastball, down and away, he's going to sit back too long, and this is going to be way too slow for him, blow by! So we took the first pitch of that first at bat, so what am I going to do? I'm going to throw him a strike this time first at bat, and I'm going to prove to you guys that he's taking a take. You see, he takes this, a pitch in the zone. Check this out. He likes fastballs, he swings at them. So we're going to throw it above the zone. He can't lay off of it. Get out of my box! Yeah, you want to take the two pitches in the zone thinking you're going to get a third one? You're not, sweetheart, blow by! All right, let's see if Captain Dumbass is still trying to tunnel. He is. Now he's using the change-ups. Is this guy going to learn, or are we going to have to run up the score on him? Because I will. I will run up the score on you, buddy. Javi Lopez at the dish. First pitch, he's going to throw us a cutter, and right where the slider was, but it doesn't fool me. Three to nothing. Ronald Acuna Jr., Ronald McDonald up at the dish, and he's going to throw us a change-up. I think that's a change-up. We're out in front on that, but it's going to get over his head. That's what you get. <laughs> Put it this way, if you're going to tunnel pitches, do it on the edges of the zone. This guy has no chance in this game. He actually got lucky that that wasn't gone. We're going to tag up. I'm pretty sure Vladdy doesn't have the arm to throw at speed, and he doesn't. But yeah, don't tunnel. Okay, not like this guy. You're going to get blasted if you want to be competitive. Don't do it like that. If, you're want, if you want to troll, then go ahead. And speaking of trolling, yeah, we take those. 5 nothing. If this guy wants to... I don't know if he's trying to disrespect me or if he's actually just this bad or if he's giving up now. But 5 nothing. I don't really know what to do. High fastball. Let's try to get a blow-by. Uh, it's not a blow-by. What changed? This guy went from giving up. Now he wants to try again. It's like it's too late for that, bud. So a two-seamer inside with Kimbrel, and he's going to hit this out of the zone, and it looks like he's going to get himself to third base. I don't get it, game. All right, he's going to score a second run here. We're going to try and get him out of first. Why did we give him that many bloops that inning? Give him two. Like, why? It doesn't matter. He, homie's a dumbass at base running. He thought I was going to throw home. We win. You guys have been asking for more content, so we're actually going to do a second game in this video. Barry Larkin to lead things off against David Price. Haven't seen this card in a while. He throws a slider. Outside the zone for the first pitch, he's going to his bullpen. He's nervous, and you know what? Judging by that ERA, I'm going to guess that we're going to have some fun with you, bud. All right, let's see here. He seems like a good player because he actually throws pitches out of the zone. Line drive to right field. This is going to get down and one hop off the wall. Is he going to tunnel like the last guy? Back-to-back -back sliders out of the zone, so two Zemer is very expected. After that, I expected it to be down and away, honestly, but a base hit. Eddie Matthews at the dish, one of my favorite cards, honestly, right now. He's been raking ball one again. We're not chasing that slider. You can throw that as many times as you want. I have a good eye, and I've always had a good eye. It's just been me sometimes getting full when I don't play enough, but right now I'm playing. I'm cracked again. Like, dude, what does this guy, who does this guy think he is? Does he not know who he's playing? You got to throw better pitches than that. There. Obviously, auto-taking 3-0. Because he's going to try, because I want him to load the bases. Now he's probably going to give us that two-seamer. Yep, okay. So we know what he's doing. Now we're going to stop our auto-taking. If we like this pitch, we will swing. And he throws the same pitch. This guy just does not have the pitching. He's not a bad pitcher, though. But he just doesn't have it enough to pitch against me. See what he does here after that slider. And there we go. He actually did fool me there. I thought that was going to be the two-seamer that he's been tunneling. But unfortunately for him, we have the timing. Two to zero. 
He keeps throwing that inside fastball. I'm going to swing at it next time. Yeah, you might have it out of the zone. We have the timing and we have the piece on it. You're not going to find a pitch that you can get me consistently out with. Three to nothing. Looks like we're going to have Tom Seaver on the bump for us. Usually does pretty solidly change up. He's out in front. Looks like he's a little overly aggressive for the fastball. We're going to give it to him, but we're going to give it to him off the plate, breaking further off the plate and jammed him up, but in no man's land, and it's going to get past a lucky hit, but that's what happens when you do that. It's risky. Sinker down and away, and he's out in front on it, but he's going to get it to fall in, so two solid hits by my opponent. Let's put this slider inside off the zone, so he hits it to a right fielder, and he bloops it in the center. All right, this is fluke now. I can't accept it. Stop it, Gameville. Okay, change up off the plate. Maybe this will get it to be hit to the right fielder. He pulls that for a fucking base hit. What is going on? And out of nowhere, he has developed an amazing eye. Two seamers swung on a miss. We're trying to vent it with this sinker and get ourselves out of this inning. Why did I say sinker? I meant to say slider. Look at this. All of a sudden, he can take pitches because now he's in the driver's seat. Now he's getting everything to fall. We got to get him to swing at this slider. But we do. He's out in front. He slammed in the corner early. That's what's supposed to happen. Get out of my box. Acuna Jr., Ronald McDonald up. And it seems like this guy is trying to cap. He's trying to make it to her. Every time I swing, the ball's out of the zone. He doesn't understand. I see what he's doing. He's not going to fool me with the high two-seamer in the right corner after being in the left corner. I know what you're doing. I'm reading your thoughts. Dwight Evans up now. Really nice swing out of a left-hander. And we kind of know what he's doing at this point. Low in the zone to left. He's... Oh, look at this guy. Now he's running the prime parry because his pitching isn't working and he's trying to cheese his way to a win. Not on my watch. Forkball in the zone. Base hit. And you know what? We're going to bring in parry of our own now after this. Barry Larkin backup has a pretty good history against people who use parry. And he's already had some ninth inning magic against parry users on my other accounts. And he throws a screwball. We're going to make the adjustment. And next time he throws that screwball, it's going to be crushed if it's in the zone. Instead, he goes with a fork ball. Make your mistake, buddy. I just hit that once, and it wasn't fluke. Unlike yours, I'm on these pitches, and they're following him because of good contact. Four to two. Reggie Jackson versus Perry, and this pitch is out of the zone, but guess what? They give it back. That is what you get. We're putting up the sad face because you tried to cheese us, and you're getting lit up. Five to two. And since this guy wants to try to cheese his way to a win, which isn't going to work, we're going to bring it in as well. The only difference is we know how to pitch with Perry. You're not going to hit us hard at all. Curveball, jam you up. You're sitting for the screwball or for the cutter. Who knows? But one out. All right, let's go to the bread and butter of Perry. Pull by. Cutter upstairs and pull by. Chipper, right field, and they're going to save him. Get him off the mound. Get him off my mound. You suck. Perry sucks. Get off my game. 